Mosul, Iraq. November 9 forces were targeted in three attacks in Iraq on Thursday. But there were no wounded. U.S. military officials and security sources. The most common days since the assets. Israel strikes strikes Grevler. Hamas the conflict began. A separate official. A separate U.S. official. Said there were four attacks against troops in Iraq and Syria in the last 24 hours. The authority added that three U.S. troops were slightly injured and returned to office. On Thursday morning, a U.S.-led coalition convoy was targeted by an improvised explosive device explosion near the Mosul Dam. But it did not cause any loss. Security sources said that the patrol was accompanied by Iraqi anti-terror forces and that a vehicle in the patrol was damaged. Again on Thursday morning, a one-way drone was launched against U.S. and coalition forces at Ain al-Assad Air Base in west of Baghdad. But before he reached his goal, he was shot without damaging loss or infrastructure. According to security sources, a drone was launched at the Al-Harir Air Base in Erbil in Erbil. But it was dropped before reaching its target. The U.S. military official said that they do not have any updates regarding the regulations in force. In force throughout Iraq and Syria. Pentagon. 56 U.S. staff were injured in attacks on traumatic brain injuries or minor injuries. But all of them returned to duty. Anbar Kamal Ayash. Jamal al-Badarani Mosul, Ahmed Rashid Baghdad and Timur Azari Baghdad and Idris Ali Washington.